you want to use a kata in a real fight, don't practice against karate attacks. Because nobody on the street is going to attack you in a deep stance with a perfectly straight punch. It just doesn't happen like that. A more realistic way is to practice real attacks that a thug would do, like pushing you, grabbing you, throwing you, getting into that clinching situation and stand up grappling. That's how you actually use kata techniques in a real fight. I picked 10 different kata that I'm gonna show you the bunkai, the practical application for. I'm gonna demonstrate how to use the opening sequence of each and every one of these kata in a real fight. The first kata is called empi or one shoe, and the opening sequence looks like this. Here's the bunkai. The key to this bunkai is to unbalance your opponent by pulling their arm as you drop down and block their leg. The next kata is called Seiyan Chin. For this bunkai, all you do is an arm drag to get your opponent's back for a quick takedown. Next kata is Basai Dai. This move is simply a guillotine choke, where you grapevine your leg to prevent him from escaping. The fourth kata is Shisochin. These movements are repeated three times in a row. This bunkai is just a pummeling drill for the clinch. And if you close your hands, you get another kata called Seisan. Next kata is called Gankaku or Chinto originally. This bunkai is a quick joint lock followed up by strikes. Number six is Pinan Godan or Heian Godan as it's called in modern karate. Control your opponent with a single underhook. Then bicep control the opposite side before executing a classic hip throw. Kata number seven is called Saifa. This bunkai is Waki Gatame in Japanese. It consists of an elbow lock plus a back fist. Next kata is Kushanku or Kanku Dai. For this bunkai, we defend our face, then extend our flinch response to an effective bear hug takedown. Kata number 9 is Kudurumfa. In this case, we create a frame in the clinch to make some space and stomp the leg out. Next kata is Pinan or Heian Yondan. Pull one arm and lift the other in a circular motion as you pivot around and throw the opponent over your leg. Let's do a bonus kata. This is Naihanshin or Teki Nida. Step in with your hips, use your arms and sweep the legs away. It's just as easy as it looks. Last but not least, one more bonus, Heian Shodan. If you end up in a strong neck clinch, reach around and twist your opponent as you lunge into a deep stance. Kata will never start to make sense in a real fight unless you start studying Bunkai. Now that you've seen these 10 Bunkai, answer me this. 
What street fighting technique do you wanna learn how to defend against? Just leave a comment and let me know one attack that you wanna learn the defense against and I'm gonna do my best to show you how to defend against that using kata techniques. And after you've left that comment, check out my other videos to learn even more about the art, science, knowledge, history, culture, and philosophy of old and new karate, because there is so much to learn if you just take your time. Train hard, good luck, and have fun.